My name is Max Strang. I'm an architect and welcome to the subtropics here in Fort Lauderdale, Florida. This is a fascinating house in the fact that it is an evolution of Florida modernism. It's really a site-specific and climate-driven design. For me, what makes this house especially interesting is how we've incorporated these long spans and also some architectural elements that provide shade, protection from the sun, provide privacy. And when those things all work together, you get some really fascinating architecture. Once you enter the great room, you're rewarded with some great views, long views down the whole new river. This home probably has more European white oak inside it than you'll ever see. It really warms up the place considerably. It makes the house much more livable. So the drop ceilings that you'll find in the great room, they mimic what's going on with the architecture of the exterior as well. We have some of these same long, clean lines that really uh, define the spaces in some, in some creative ways. The kitchen is a great example of merging casual spaces and formal ideas in, in one space. I think you'll find this kitchen has a you know, variety of materials from super sleek cabinets and countertops. You know, the kitchen is really uh, the heart of the house where the stairs from the second floor come down. It has two ways to access it from the great room and it's also got a really interesting glass bridge connection to the guest wing of the house. Transitional spaces are super important in this house, and we put a lot of thought into what those spaces would be like. So this house has some really unique long corridors that connect the spaces. On the second floor, it links the master bedroom with the two kids' bedrooms and the home office at the end. Over in the guest wing, there is a pretty phenomenal screening room, and there's these vertical dividers that are designed to really either close off the space for a full media experience or to open up and really connect two spaces of that screening room. And those vertical dividers, you know, they are, again, it's something you see on the exterior of the house and it's a theme that we bring through the interior as well. The master suite consists of the master bedroom, a sitting area, an expansive master bathroom, closets, and there's also a little gym tucked to the side. Once you go in and enter the master suite, you really get a sense of these vertical fins that I spoke about on the exterior. These fins, they provide a little more privacy. The bathing areas are really spectacular as well. It's almost like an outdoor shower. I hope you enjoyed exploring this house with me. This house in Fort Lauderdale, it really sums up that Florida living, that coastal living. For me personally, I just love the way that it advances those timeless concepts of modernism from Florida's past. Thank you for watching and thank you for exploring this, this home with me. Uh, it's really one of my favorites and uh, I hope you liked it too. Thanks for watching. Like what you see on the show? Well, be sure to subscribe to our channel. We have so many more beautiful homes to share. How about love? Share these homes, you know?